Hey guys, this is Max with Alpha Gaming 16, and I'm going to be showing you how to flash a custom ROM on the HTC Inspire 4G. Now to let you know, I'm not responsible for if anything bad happens to your phone, and you must be required be rooted for this to work. So first app, the easiest way to do it, the first app you're going to want to get is called ROM Manager. What this does is this is a app that you can download custom ROMs from and it'll install them and make the whole process a lot easier but if you want you can download them from the internet. Another app that I love a lot is Titanium Backup. In this app you can back up all of your user info and profiles and stuff because to to um, install a custom ROM you have to delete everything. So, so, so what we're gonna do is go back to ROM manager and choose a custom ROM that you want from the download ROM section. All of these ones you can see premium are you have to pay for the ROM manager premium. I'm going to be showing you this one called RC Mix by the RC team. It's an HTC Sense one like you could see that's what I had on. And what you're going to want to do is just click this and then click download. But I already have it downloaded. So I'm just going to be showing you what you need to do. So, what will happen is once that's finished downloading, a picture will come up here on your screen that should say Wipe Delvic Cache, Wipe System Cache, and Wipe System Data. What you're going to want to check off is check off Wipe Delvic Cache and Wipe S System Data. And then that'll bring you to this screen. I'm just going to be showing you. Restart, and it'll. this is what it's going to look like. And that's just a custom shutting down logo that comes with this, or boot, or custom boot down animation that comes with this um, ROM. So it's gonna boot up into recovery, and then if I did this the actual way, what it would do is when it goes into um, recovery, it would just straight up start installing the ROM, and then all you gotta do is hit. You can see right here. You can hit reboot. When it's done, just go back to this and hit reboot system now. And if you don't want to do it the way from the ROM manager, just go to install zip from SD card. Then go to that. And then go to the first one, choose zip. And it would be, and if you downloaded it with ROM manager, you scroll down with the volume buttons and be in clockwork mod and there's download oh wait it's not it's not in there it should it'll you'll be able to um it actually would be here like you can see that there's I have like sense and Android revolution so once that's done just go back to the beginning pages or this and then hit reboot system now and if it's your first time with this um user interface and custom ROM. It might take a while to reboot, reboot but my, or, um, mine's gonna reboot pretty fast because I've had this um, running for quite a while. An RC mix really improves the battery life of the HTC Inspire. Normally the battery life is pretty bad, but I'm, this makes it a lot better. And I have a custom boot logo on, so cause I don't really like the RC mix one, so the one I have on. And once this is done, I'm loading up, you have successfully loaded a custom ROM onto your HTC Inspire 4G. And I'll just wait a little bit and here it is. And this is the custom ROM. And with RC Mix, it is based on the um, the HTC Sensations one. So, it comes with this thing called Beats Audio. So, you can see when I... Hmm, sorry. For some reason my music's not loading. Here, I'll go to the library. Oh, my SD card has to load up for a second. Okay. 
and it comes with this, or I'm not going to do it right now, but it comes with Beats Audio, which really increases the sound of your music, and it also comes with um, this new thing where you can install the HTC Bliss, which is why this is, looks like this and that, and there's this new widget that looks really nice, and you've probably seen it on that song, the HT, or that um, phone, the HTC Bliss, and I'll show you the... Um, how the Beats logo comes up. I'll play. Uh, um, I'll just choose a song here. I'm gonna. You can see up there. Beats audio enabled, and you can disable it, and it sounds a lot better. So that's it. That's how to flash a ROM. It should work for any ROM out there. And remember to like, favorite, and subscribe to Alpha Gaming 16 and have a nice day guys